Hello everyone. In this presentation, I will introduce you my introduction to VHDL semester project. My project name is Analog and Digital Clocks on Vega. And my advisor is Errol Seke and I am Vaisal Aksoy. In this project, an analog and digital clock will be shown on Vega screen and they will have some features like stopwatch and alarm. They will be adjustable and they can be able to be plotted on the screen in order to take bonus points. There will be multiple clocks that are independent of each other on the screen. Here my, my presentation outline is In this project, I used all information that comes from introduction to VHDL lessons. I used clock divider, character RAM, multiplexers, and other components in this project. Before designing the project, I did a flow chart that is shown in the figure. To clarify the operation of the project, when the project is on the main screen, you will see only the main icon location information and two clocks if you click on to the menu icon you will open selection there are six main selection and they have different tasks here uh, the figure includes all of components of the project The figure demonstrates the block diagram of timer and chronometry and how they both are generated. According to the schematic, there are two signals comes to multiplexer and there is a switch that is used to select one of mode. The selected signal is sent to timer and reverse counter. In timer, the time is calculating and given to output as seconds, minutes, hours, ACM hours, and AC hours, integers. In reverse counter, I sent three integers, which are C second, C minutes, and C hours, and if Gerisaima signal is one, then a counter counts reversely. This is a down counter. Okay, generation of some necessary signals. The figure shows how to obtain CC, SR, alarm on, and also konum ayarlama signals. They are used in clock operations to do exact operation. First, I obtained CC signal with multiplexer and selection bits come from RM bits. Second, I obtained konum ayarlama integer by using a 2-bit up counter. Clock signal of the counter is supplied by an gate which is connected with button 5 and such an egg 1 signals if the user push button 5 when such an occurs to 2 then konumayarlama counts 1 third i use the comparator to know whether normal time occurs to the set time the time used to set an alarm the output of comparator generates alarm on signal which will be used in other areas later. Fourth, I used a multiplexer to select among three steels, Istanbul, Ohio and London. Selection bit come from Shehir integer and it is created by a counter whose clock signal is Connected with such an egg across two. Okay, general block diagram of the project is shown. The figure represents the block diagram of the project. In this block diagram, selection represents circuit that make decision in order to transmit determined output to the monitor. Selection has many registers, counters, and mostly multiplexers 
that are 2 to 1 or 4 to 2 1 multiplex of types. Okay, the first uh, feature. The first one is rank selection. And if you click on the button right in this selection point, you will change the colors of the clocks from white to green and then red for each click. If you click button 1, then you will go to the selection 2, which is called Shihir. The second one is Konum selection. If you click on button 5, you will be able to change the analog clocks location on the screen if you click on the button 5 one more then you will be able to change digital clock if you click on the button 5 then you will change both of them simultaneously if you click button 2 you will go back to the selection uh, 1 operation otherwise if you click button 1 you will go to the selection 3 which is called here. By using Shihir selection, you can change the city location. There are three main locations that are Istanbul, London and Ohio. Between Istanbul and Ohio, London, there are three hours differences and between Istanbul and Ohio, there are eight hour differences and between London and Ohio, there are five hours differences. In each location, clocks time are changed. If you click button 2, you will go back to the selection 2 operation. Otherwise, if you click button 1, you will go to the selection 4, which is called alarm. <coughs> By using alarm operation, you can set an alarm and there are two warning objects for this alarm. If the normal time equals to the alarm time, there will be an object at the bottom right side of the VGA, VGA screen. It will be between city information and selection 6. The other warning object is uh, connect to the basis 3 car. I connected a blink circuit to the basis 3 and when the alarm is on, it blinks. If you click button 2, you will go back to the selection 3 operation. Otherwise, if you click button 1, you will go to the selection 5, which is called chronometry. Okay, feature 5. In the chronometry, you can set a chronometry that counts uh, reversely. At the same time, the normal clock operates and it continues to count the normal time. To set chronometry, you have to push one time button 5. After pushing button 5, you will see the yellow 4 digits on the screen. If you want to increase second, you have to push button 1 and button 3 up. If you want to increase minutes, you have to push both button 2 and button 3. If you want to decrease seconds, you have to push button 1 and button 4 simultaneously. If you want to decrease minutes, you have to push button 2 and button 4. After setting the chronometry, push the button 5 to start it. If the chronometry finishes its reverse counting, push button 5 to exit this feature. If you click button 2, you will go back to the selection for operation. Otherwise, if you click button 1, you will go to the selection 6, which is called Ayarlama. Feature 6. Uh, in the Ayarlama selection, you can set the other clock. First, you have to use button 5, and then each clicks change from seconds to hours, and the last one represents quick. If you click button 2, you will go back to the selection 5 operation. Otherwise, if you click button 1, you will go to the selection 0, which is called menu icon. In the menu icon, 
you can close the menu. If you push the button 5, if you push button 1, then you go to the selection 1. Here I put my references. Thanks for joining me. We will watch uh, my semester project short video. Uh, I will show everything in the video. Let's watch together. Hello everyone. My name is Vaisal Aksol and I will present you my semester introduction to HDL project in this video. First, uh, the project is controlled by basis 3 card with the uh, 5 buttons which are on the basis 3 card. If you click on to the object which is uh, left and the bottom side of the screen you will open the menu you can move on right or left on the menu and you can select the uh, type of the operation by using the button if you click on to the rank operation you will change uh, the color of the clocks and if you click on to the corner you can change the position of the clock In the share operation, if you click on that, uh, you will can change the region of the clock. And there are three types of regions: there are London, Ohio, and Istanbul. If you click on to the alarm operation, you can set an alarm for yourself and uh, that can warn you when the time is equal to the normal time. And if you look at this little screen, you can understand there are two LEDs which are turning on and off when the al alarm is on. And uh, there are two type of uh, frequency on the uh, clocks. If you select the other one, you will speed up the clocks, and you can reach any point directly and quickly. And here I set the alarm 8 minutes one more time and I'm waiting for it. If the alarm equals to the normal uh, hours and clocks 
uh, there will be a sign as I said you before and in the little screen you, as you can see there are two LEDs which are uh, blinking if you select the chronometer operation uh, you can use the clock as an chronometer and you can set it and it will decrease time until it goes to zero as this operation uh, happens the clock normal clock operates normally and the time is same I changed frequency a little bit and it is quick now If you select the IRLM operation, you can change the clock time and you have to select the other quick frequency to set this on a clock. Here I change the stays one more. The color of the clock right now is uh, red, but because of the low quality of the camera, it, it looks different. And my video presentation is like that. Thanks for your attention.